how to differentiate index function for the simplest index function we have a to the power of x so a is called the base and x is the index so when differentiate a to the power of x we are going to differentiate the power in this case we get 1 and then we are going to copy back the question and we have to take ln of the base so the result is a to the power of x ln a for example if we have fx is equals to 2 to the power of x so f prime x will be equals to differentiating the power we have 1 and copy back the question we have 2 to the power of x and then we have to take ln of the base ln 2 so the answer is <coughs> 2 to the power of x ln 2 if m is a scalar when we differentiate mx we get m and we copy the question and we are going to ln the base if we have a to the power of fx we have to differentiate fx first so we obtain f prime x and we copy the question and we are going to take ln of the base so that is the answer for the simplest index function if e to the power of x differentiate e to the power of x we are going to get e to the power of x if we differentiate e to the power of mx we have to differentiate the power first so we obtain m and the result is e to the power of mx if we differentiate e to the power of fx so we differentiate fx first we obtain f prime x and we copy back e to the power of fx now we are going to try a few questions so for question a the dy dx is differentiate the power we get 1 and we copy back the question and then we take ln of the base so the answer is 5 to the power of x ln 5 for b when differentiate the power we got 3 and then we copy back the question and then we are going to ln the base so this is the answer for B and for C our dy dx is differentiate the power we get negative 1 and then we copy back the question and then we are going to ln the base so that is the answer now let's try example 2 find dy dx for each of the following functions so the dy dx is equals to differentiate the power we get 4 e to the power of 4x and for question b our dy dx is we have to differentiate the power first so we obtain 6x and then we just copy back the question so we have e to the power of 3x squared plus 5 for c our dy dx is we have to differentiate the power so differentiating the power we are going to get 3 5 minus x square and then differentiate inside the bracket we get negative 1 and then we just copy back the question so the answer will be negative 3 5 minus x square e to the power of 5 minus x cubed now let's try example 3 find dy dx for each of the following functions so we have three questions I am going to discuss question A and B and you can try C by yourself so let's solve A for A we have to use product rule So now u is equals to x and u prime is equals to 1. Our v is exponent 4x and v prime is 4 exponent 4x. And then finding dy dx by using product rule. 
the formula is u v prime plus with v u prime so the answer will be 4x e to the power of 4x plus with e to the power of 4x for question b we have to use quotient rule so our u is 3x plus 2 And our u prime is 3. Our v is ex. So our v prime is also ex. So using quotient rule, so we have now dy dx is equals to v u prime minus with u v prime divide by v square so we have exponent x square so it is 3 exponent x minus with 3x exponent x minus with 2 exponent x over exponent x square so we can factorize exponent x so we have 3 minus 3x minus 2 divide by exponent x square so I'm going to cancel exponent x here so the final answer will be 3 minus 3x minus 2 divide by exponent x for this question please try by yourself and submit to your lecturer as a proof that you watch this video thank you